am so so excited for this one you all know how much i love farmer bob so this one is farmer bob bobland and it is like a circus kind of thing or like a carnival i don't really know how to explain it but finding unicorn the makers of farmer bob has done this thing where every single time for bob now there's like two different sets and then each set will have like um special figures and that's kind of what this one is so um let's take a look at the two different styles so first and foremost this is what the box looks like it is so cute it's the same one as the box and honestly these two on the box you'd think this would be like uh, set one and set two but no they're both from the same set which is style one so this is style one there's eight right here but the ninth one is this one the rat knight so the rat knight is part of style one and then the rest is style two so that's part of style one rat knight and then these uh eight options right here I really want style one I'll be honest I like both of them but if I have to say I have a preference it would be style one this is kind of the one I want and then there's six special versions there's ten in total in the box which means that you're guaranteed one of the special colors basically and then style two let me just cover up the night this is style two like I said it's still cute but I really really want style one I like this and this one a lot and those are the two covers there um, but here's style two and then there is a possibility of two secrets the big secret is so cute it's like a stone version of the king of dreamland so hopefully that was not too confusing but that's what the box looks like i like that it's like a metallic sheen all the way around so i am so excited and i'm actually really nervous to go into opening but let's go ahead and open our box number one this one will tell us which style we got fingers crossed hopefully it's style one but okay deep breaths all right so you guys already know the finding unicorn boxes are not very nice to open Ooh, okay i'm so nervous i am so nervous i don't want any spoilers i'm trying to fight off anything i can no no spoilers oh yeah the card is in there so okay it's backwards this way i forgot that they like tape their things all the time so i'm gonna tear this off and put it to the side let's take a look at this bag look at this bag it's very cute but it screams retro to me like it's adorable it just says bobland on there okay okay i am literally so nervous my heart rate is probably going a mile a minute oh my gosh. let's see what series we get oh my gosh we have we have style one I had to compose myself because I literally was screaming so much because we got style one. Okay, Mr. Hot Dog uh, is what this figure is called. He is not my favorite, but he is part of style one, which means I got the style that I wanted. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So, okay, whew, deep breaths. All right, I am going to start talking about Mr. Hot Dog. So, Farmer Bob has blue eyes blonde hair he is very glossy so the ring light is reflected i'm so sorry about that um and then all the way around he's just so cute he doesn't have a cart he's not holding anything um he has no accessories but this is what he looks like um of course he's a hot dog man so this is mr hot dog the figure and this is our card i'm so excited about style one but it's kind of like one of those where it's like, oh, I love style one. But now that I got style one, I'm like, oh, I want style two. <laughs> I hate myself sometimes. So let's see. Hopefully it's backwards. Yep, it is. So let's see what this one is. I heard an accessory in the bag, but we'll get that in a little bit. Let's get our main figure. This one is ooh, Dark Duke. That is so cute. So this is what Dark Duke looks like. He's so adorable. He has that like bob hair that I love, which is like that jelly type. And it's um, it's kind of see-through. It's really adorable. I know it doesn't like translate so much on camera, but it's like that jelly cell. It's so cute. And it's the cutest little vampire. Look at him, his um, boots, his cape, and then all the way around. Oh, so it's purple on the inside, by the way. And then around there is, you can see the fangs. Oh, it's so cute. I love this one. So this this is the figure for Dark Duke, and this is our card. So on to number three. My favorite um, like special color is actually from 
style one as well, which is a variation of this one. Um, so I don't know how lucky I'm going to be and actually get like two things that I, this is the coin, two things that I want in one box. So I don't know. We'll take a look. I mean, I was, I'm really excited. I even got style one. So I'm not going to put too much thought into it, but hopefully I get this special that I want. This one is oh this is the monument explorer so this is monument explorer i love this one i love when bob is so matte like ugh, i have a thing for matte bombs <laughs> that sounds weird but look at his glasses he's so cute and then his hat his, ex his explorer hat his shirt with like the two pockets the belt it's so cute and then the hunter green boots are to die for like it even has what do you call them like um treads like the boot treads <sighs> Bob is just so cute. The details are so cute. Uh, I'm obsessed with this one just because the mat just gives Bob like a super cute look to him. And then his backpack says stay wild and you can tell it's kind of already worn and then it's so adorable. He does have one accessory which is this magnifying glass and it actually works. So let's take a look at the glitter on my hand and then when you put it underneath like you can see the glitter a lot more. That's so adorable. So adorable. I cannot deal. So this is our figure for Monument Explorer, and this is our card. On to number four. Oh, I am still shocked that I, I don't know, that I got this. It's just so exciting to me. Ooh. Okay, Ooh, that was tough, I'm sorry. And then let's see this one. Ooh. Those like coins just keep falling off, and I'm sorry for the jump scares of the noises. All right, let's see what our next one is. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is the one I wanted. And he's matte, which <sighs> I cannot, I cannot. This is Bubble Sir. So this is Bubble Sir, he is so cute. He's my absolute favorite. And I just finished telling y'all that I love matte and I am so happy that this Bob is matte the cowboy hat with the star and then right here we have he has a bubble like nancy oh my god i cannot it's the colorway the yellow the pink the the turquoise it's the aqua it's just it's just adorable and he's the little cowboy back there on the cover so i am so so excited so let's take a look at him he does have a little gun right here on his like gun belt the boots in brown that are like all the way it even has treads as well um that has like this like um aqua color all the way around the bubblegum pink shirt that says boom on there and then the yellow shorts the gloves so adorable this one does not have a special color which can you imagine this in like all brown it would be so adorable but this is absolutely my favorite i love this one so much Ooh, so cute so this is our bubble sir figure and this is our card number i don't even know five i think number five i think is where we're at so let's see which this one brings us all right there we go let's take a quick look and this one is ooh, this is the puppet theater this is the one that looks like peter pan to me or no not peter pan pinocchio so seeing this one in person makes me like this more. I mean, I just kind of glazed over him in the pictures, but look at the details. The wood coloring on his face and his ear, it's just so well made. And then the little screws on his arms, that's that's really, really good details. That's so cute, even on his legs. Like any exposed skin, it looks like they did a wonderful job. Even the back, this is just adorable. So he's wearing this green overall with like a lighter green shirt underneath. And then he does have that like Robin Hood-esque hat, which is so cute. This one, I did not expect a lot from this, but this one is really cute. I approve. So this is the puppet theater figure, and this is our card. All right, on to number six. We already officially passed the halfway point since there's 10 in total. So let's see this one. Oop, there's the coin again. Sorry for the jump scare noise. And let's open this one. Ooh, this is our confession balloon. This is the other one that I wanted. This is the regular color. 
So I misspoke according to the card. It's called Anniversary Balloon, which I'm kind of confused about because I thought the special color was called Anniversary Balloon, but what do I know? I didn't make them. So um, this one is called Anniversary Balloon. This is the special colorway, the white one. This pink one is the regular one. So just wanted to let you guys know that before we get into the details. So looking at the figure, you, we all see that he has this like hat slash crown of a cat or a bunny maybe but it is like made to look like balloon animals and it doesn't translate on the camera but it is kind of see-through like it's kind of made of like a jellyish like almost like a balloon really it's really cute so even in the back they tied it like that it's so adorable and then he is holding two balloons this one is the white one and then this one looks like a um, Rico's friend I don't know if you guys are familiar with Rico. I'm not a big Rico fan, so I know I haven't shown Rico in this channel, but he's also another um, Finding Unicorn character. And this looks like Rico's friend. So the black balloon. And then he's wearing these suspenders with this like metallic glittery blue bow tie. And then the pink shirt. The shorts are polka dots. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me kind of zoom in. There you go. Um, the polka dot shorts and then the black boots. So cute. All the way around. It's so adorable. This is the other... Um, figure that I wanted from this set for sure so this is our figure for anniversary balloon and this is our card on to number seven and our special color is still hiding so I don't know we'll see what we get okay there we go all right this one is let's see this one has like a really dark Ooh. That's a coin um, card. So let's see what we got on number seven. Oh. This is the special color that we got. But I'm a little bit confused. So let me explain my confusion real quick. Because of course we got set A. Okay, we know that. Or set one. And then this, besides this one, this is set two. And then the special colors. Now, the special color that we got is um, the Halloween one, the one with the cat ears, which is a special color of this one in set two, which is called Midnight Ghost. From here, you can see it, this is the one we got. So I don't... I thought the special colors had to correlate with the style number, but I guess not because the special color we got is... The special color of something from style two that's why i was a little bit confused so yeah i don't know but i digress back to our normal programming this is the special surprise style that we got this one is called halloween practical joke and this this is kind of actually really cute look at the cape it has like a jack-o-lantern pattern in the back this cape is translucent and then we do have this like cat face right there which is so adorable he is holding on to like a piece of candy which is kind of funny so i'm thinking that's a practical joke it's probably not candy so <laughs> he is wearing a full-on orange top and a matching short set and then i do love this like lavender boot it's so cute so this is our figure for halloween practical joke and this is our card so on to number eight and i'm so sorry about that confusion like i guess i just don't know the rules <laughs> so here we go let's see which one we get for number eight this one is the sad clown or I don't think it's called the sad clown it's called the lonely clown so this is what the lonely clown looks like he has pink hair with a party hat and then this like ruffle it's so cute and then his shorts are polka dots he's not holding anything um he has the white boots on and then all the way around the cute thing about this one is he has a magnetized mask for being lonely and mask has a little tear that's so sad so this one is so cute to me this one had a special color all in black and white so this is the figure for lonely clown and this is our card we are now at number nine so we're almost to the end Ooh, let's see which one we get on this one That was the coin again. All right, I just really love these colors. It's very like retro to me. 
Ooh, we have the Rat Knight. So this is the Rat Knight. He has like the mouse ears. I love this like aqua beard he has going on. The little rocking horse there. And then with his white boots and then it's pink soles. That's so cute. And then in the back he has a little rat. He has a little rat tail is what I mean. Um, I'll be honest, this isn't one of the ones I was like super excited about um, as far as the designs are concerned. But he was part of style one. So this is our figure for Rat Knight, and this is our card. So this is our last one. We are missing, ooh, wrong side, um, the Wonderful Store, which is, this is actually like the special color that I wanted because it's so cute. He has a Dalmatian dog with him. Or we may get a secret because I obviously don't know the rules anymore. It's just, there are no rules. <laughs> So let's take a look at this last one. Okay, that's the card. And let's take a look. And it is the Wonderful Store, which is a really good last pull. So this is the Wonderful Store with his accessory, which is a bag. And the bag is a yellow bag with Bob on it. Like, do you guys see it? That's so cute. And this is what he looks like. He has a polar bear bucket hat and it's yellow on the underside. And look at the ears. Oh, they're, I'm trying to figure out. No, they're not flocked. It's not flocked, but it is so cute. And you guys already know I love a good matte Bob. So the glasses, the beard, the overalls, the polka dot shirt. Yeah, this one definitely love love this one what a great last pull this is the wonderful store figure and this is our card so these are all 10 of our bobs the special one is right up there and um this is style one or set a whichever one you guys want to call it and i am so so happy to get this set Everything is so cute. I love it so much. I still don't know how I feel about the two different sets because I feel like you have to keep buying them and then you don't know if you're gonna get a dupe set, which kind of defeats the purpose. I don't know. So I still haven't jumped in and bought two sets of the bobs just because I, I don't wanna run into that issue and they're not cheap. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing with me and I hope to see you guys on the next one. Bye.